guys. Hey guys. Hi, hello. So we uh we we're gonna do a little video where we taste our peppers. As you can see, they're not that big. Most peppers usually get to be about the size of a hand. These are not quite they're very that big. tiny. They're very tiny, but we are gonna eat them like little snack peppers. So we're gonna go ahead and just yeah, we grew these. They're our babies. Cut the cap off first. We're gonna eat our babies. We're eating our babies, yeah. There we go. So this, look at the little tiny seeds yeah, inside. Yeah, you, you guys can see this. Seeds aren't fully developed. Some of them are. Others are not. I'm gonna go ahead and take some of these out of here that are, and try and actually replant them later. But I'm gonna go ahead and cut what's left of this. Make a baby from the actual baby. fruit from the. Careful, I don't want to break our pl plate. Yeah, I'll try not to. Okay, cut all the fruit off of the cap, and then I'm going to take the cap, and I'm just going to set it right here for now. Now, it looks like there are still some seeds on the meat inside, so I'm going to get those out too. Get Careful. that little bit of meat out. Cut this in half. I'm not a huge fan of raw peppers, so this should be fun. Mmm. Mm. And being thinner, it's a little bit more like a chip. Oh, it's bitter. <laughs> bitter for you? Well, the yellow ones are usually a little sour. So. Oh, I wish I had something to wash it down with. I'm thirsty. It's okay. I'll grab my water when we're done. Trying to be careful. I don't want to cut into that. Oh. oh, you didn't get the cap. I didn't get deep enough for that. Wow. Those seeds are not good. No, none of these seeds are really. Well, there's still a few seeds in here that might be viable, but we've already got too many plants and the plants are going to reflower. So I'm not too worried about actually reusing these. Yeah, we don't need this. These are the first. Plant. This is our first crop, meaning the harvest is going to be small and weak. We're not going to get very great peppers out of this to begin with. They are very, very stiff. I don't know if it's because I've been, I've refrigerated them for too long or not, but... Wow, that has some crunch mm -hmm. and is very sweet. Still can taste kind of bitter to me, but they taste like peppers. They taste like bell peppers. They're good. All okay, right, the so last one. A yellow, a this red. is our largest, best one. It's the most bell pepper shaped. So we're going to see. What the hell is that? And It's got something stuck in its butt crack. Anyway, I'm just going to go ahead and I shave off I think it's the red, but it kind of looks orange. I'm just going to shave this one around the core for funsies. Oh, it was growing another pepper inside the pepper. Well, what you know about that? There you go. Just oh, look, there's another one right there. Wow, yeah, so some of these seeds are extremely viable because they're growing already inside the pepper. There you go. Just gonna break it open and eat it. Woo, that one is tart. Mm. That one very much tastes like an orange. Weird. It actually has a very citrusy taste to it. It's very, yeah, acidic. Well, he's the fan of peppers, so we can eat, eat all of these. I'm, I'm all good on continuing. Make yourself a little kebab without the kebab. We have edible not bad peppers we did it we do it we, we did grew it. food we grew food and you can too don't forget guys take some dirt from your yard a bag of dirt you have in your garage throw it in a jar a pot an empty bowl something that you're okay with letting sit and get dirty for months and months on end take it throw the seeds take this bit you see this you see it when you cut you know you people cut this out and then throw it away they just poop toss it Take Don't this, toss it. Put just, it in the dirt. Put it right in the dirt. Especially if you're getting organic produce from your grocery store. Just put this right in the dirt. 
guaranteed after a couple of weeks you're going to start to see some seedlings. Just keep the dirt damp, not soaked, damp, and you will start to see seedlings. And within a month's time, you should have a plant that's fairly sizable, and in eight months, you should have actual fruit. Ours took a while because we live in an environment that's not compatible for peppers. And we didn't peppers. plant them at the best time of year. No. But it did, so it did take us a while to get them to grow. However, if you want to grow your own peppers or any produce, we've got lemon trees, peppers, we grew tomatoes, or we had a tomato plant. It never actually, well, it did grow some tomatoes, but it didn't grow large enough to Large tomatoes, tomato. no, just tiny ones. But you can do it too. So go do it. Whatever you choose to do. Stay immortal. Don't go dying on us. We love all of you. And how do I end this thing? <laughs> how do I end this thing? There and we we'll go. see Bye. you next time. Bye.